Anne left her chambers at the tower a little before eight o'clock in the morning. Awaiting her at the end of this short journey was an expert French swordsman summoned by Henry as an act of mercy. For a dignified execution befitting a queen, a scaffold had been erected inside the walls of the tower, away from the public. An eyewitness reported Anne's final words. Good Christian people, I'm come hither to die. For according to the law, and by the law, I'm judged to die. Therefore, I shall speak nothing against it. I'm come hither to accuse no man, or to speak anything of that, whereof I'm accused and condemned to die. But I pray God save the king and send him long to reign over you all. For a gentler nor a more merciful prince was there never. And to me, he was ever a good, a gentle, sovereign lord. And if any person will meddle of my cause, I require them to judge the best. And thus, I take my leave of this world and of you all. And I heartily desire you all to pray for me. O oh Lord God, have mercy on my soul to Christ. I commend them. Jesus, receive my soul. O oh Lord God, have mercy on my soul. The Queen of England was beheaded with a single clean strike of the French blade.